Hey guys. Welcome to Couple. Please like and subscribe if you like this video. The police chief of a small Georgia town is defending an officer who deployed a stun gun on a smiling 87-year-old woman, saying she refused to comply with numerous commands to put down a kitchen knife she was using to cut dandelions. But relatives of the octogenarian, Martha Albishera, say police failed to use good common sense to prevent the incident from quickly escalating to a use-of-force confrontation in Chatsworth that landed their diminutive matriarch in handcuffs. We have nothing but love for this county, but within that context, we think that what happened is absolutely ridiculous, Al Bishra's grandson, Timothy Dunny, a 24-year-old medical student, told ABC News on Wednesday. If they had calmed down, de-escalated the situation, listened a little bit, we wouldn't be having this issue right now. Unfortunately, that's not what happened. She told us she was smiling at them to tell them that she wasn't a threat, and she was trying to get closer to them to communicate with them, and that's when they tossed her, he said. Murray County Jail via APA photo released by the Murray County Jail, in GA showing Martha Albishera, 87, who was charged with criminal trespass and obstructing an officer, August 10, 2018. My grandmother is a human being who they didn't have any patience with. What happened to Mayberry, he said, referring to the fictional small North Carolina town from the old The Andy Griffith Show. Would you ever see Andy Griffith taste an 87-year-old woman? It points to a bigger problem with the lack of human interaction. But Chatsworth Police Chief Josh Etheridge said the officer had little choice but to use a taser on Al Bisher when she failed to obey numerous orders to put down the knife as the five-foot-two woman stepped toward him. He said there is police body camera footage of the incident, but he has yet to release it because charges against Al Bishra are pending. She has been ordered to appear in court on September 19. She came walking toward the officer. After multiple commands, he told her to stop several times. She continued walking at which time we deployed the taser, Etheridge said in a video statement to the Daily Citizen News of Dalton, Georgia. The incident occurred on Friday afternoon after police received a 911 call from a staffer at the Boys and Girls Club, saying, this lady is walking on the bike trail, she has a knife and she won't leave. She doesn't speak English. The caller told the dispatcher that the elderly woman did not threaten anyone with the knife. She's old so she can't get around too well, the caller said, according to the 911 call, which has been made public. Looks like she's walking around looking for something, like, vegetation to cut down or something.